Greetings and salutations. I'm Keb. Welcome back to this let's play of Sid Meier's Civilization 2 as the Celts. And I just noticed that I've been saving up money and not spending it. Uh, let's see. Uh, right, before that though, uh, we wanted to talk to the Japanese actually. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, where are you? Foreign Minister. Uh, send emissary. Yeah, 15 units because I bought a lot of them. Uh, no! Uh, uh, yeah. Never mind. Uh, did I. Okay, why didn't you get lost? Uh, foreign minister. Yeah, I had. I don't understand this. I don't already have a. Uh, I can't tell him to get lost. Uh, that kind of annoys me. That kind of annoys me. Why can't I do. Maybe. The, maybe. maybe uh, Blub words. Maybe I have to wait a th wait a few turns. Since um, he apparently didn't have a peace treaty with me, that's how what he claimed at least. And well, that's a freight. Okay. I will see. But uh, the other thing I wanted to check: uh, da -da -da -da, advisor city status is F1. Okay. We have some factories that need construction. Still, I think. Ah, uh, gonna cost a fortune, but I'm gonna do it anyway. And all factories built. And temples, because that's even a step behind. Factories and temples, and. and let's see, offshore platforms are next on the line. Spend all our money improving things. The rest of manufacturing plants. Which costs a fair bit of gold, but I don't care. I want the capacity to produce tons of buildings. say to myself those mo that, that money but nah. who cares just get things done okay that seems fine let's go yeah all right so they do withdraw they okay so for some reason it doesn't count as a peace treaty if I don't talk to them then it doesn't they, they can't automatically cancel the peace treaty they can't attack me but huh at least that's what it looks like. That's kind of odd. Oh. Well, all these small cities have to be ready. So we need to do the and stuff. Crete needs. Oh my goodness! Yeah, you need a lot of stuff. You need the factory first. Okay, go with the harbor, that's fine. Hmm. Hmm. 
You don't have a harbor either. You don't have offshore. Oh my goodness, so many buildings that I need everywhere. Yes, I can kind of understand why <laughs> they decided to curb the amount of cities you reasonably have in a civilization game. Yeah, sure, go with spices. Confirmed. Because this is just not... it's not really fun. Having to go through every single city and basically build a ton of things. So if you're capped at about 10 cities or something like that, that's actually okay. I suppose... Just go, go, and go with the top trades. Confirm and zoom, because you built the last transport. So you're gonna go build the components. the last one for you, so you're going to build two components for you too. Of course we lack the, pro the tech for modules, but... Yeah, just keep building structural pieces. So the first chunk of the spaceship is done. It's gonna take a while to finish. Um Golan has built pretty much oh there's not and I'm farmed this square, though. No. Okay, and spices were needed where? We want to find a foreign city primarily. And Trondheim seems to be a decent choice. Okay, go to Trondheim. If you can, all players. Instead of using the road, now I want to go here. Ugh. <clears throat> okay, now we can... No, send her away. Didn't take long for them to want to renegotiate stuff, I guess. One turn. But they moved away, and that's the important part. So they're no longer right on top of us. Let's see, cloth. That was needed where? Cloth, cloth, cloth. Uh, there we go, cloth. Needed in Halakonassus and Quincy. Halakonassus is probably... Not here? Where is Halakonassus? There it is, okay. Can we get to that city? No, we can't. Uh, can I airlift to Ronda or something? Go... Uh, I can't even tell him to go there. I just... Hey, you have a railroad. Like here. What about now? No, still uh, completely impossible to understand that I can go... Oops. Down here. Now! Yeah, now suddenly you find all the cities. How do you have Holikonassos in the list? There we go, go. Uh, new. No. Send her away. And uh, let's set cargo with beads. He wants beads. Thermopylae. Let's take to now. So now we have the problem with going to Thermopylae, which I probably could, but. It just won't give me that option, so we need to move manually. Oh, whoops. Now! Now we figure it's on the same continent, so... 
all players and them up today. And another one with cloth. Did I just? No. Okay. Um. This has to go to Quincy. A Mongol town somewhere. Which is actually on the same continent, if we can get there. I need to see this. Can we get to Quincy? And I wish I knew that this order is probably already settled. Yeah, okay. In the order they were settled. Looks like it. Send her away. Okay, and right now we can start improving the base, or rather, uh, doodads. Let's go with some carpets. Uh, just load up some gems. Load up the wine. The spaceship chunk. Good, good, good. And more chunks to the spaceship. Yeah, we know. It's gonna take a while for it to finish. But at least we're started. And it's not like we're exactly in a race right now. Um, wine. Who wants wine? Samarkand wants wine. Uh, is Samarkand on this continent? I don't think they are. No, Samarkand is on this continent. Uh, so that. So I need ships for that. Uh Wait, where were you? Rimney. Uh There was a ship out oh, over there. Okay, wakey wakey, little transport. Go here. Let's see if we can go all the way down to the Mongol area. And another cargo of gems. Who wants gems? A lot of towns. Um, including Cardiff. I'm gonna lift to Cardiff if I can. I can, okay. Okay, and those transports are on the way. And I wait one more turn before I do another buy round of stuffs. Nuclear power! Woohoo! In addition to its potential to its potential destruction, the energy released in nuclear fission was seen as a potential source of controlled power generation. By 1944, large-scale nuclear reactors were in operation for the production of plutonium, although the energy produced by these reactors was not used. Following World War II, increased efforts were turned toward the extensive use of nuclear power to produce electricity. Nuclear power plants were the, used the radiant energy of a controlled nuclear reaction to heat water, converting it to steam to spin turbines that generate electricity. The major drawback to nuclear fission is the lack of a safe means of disposal for the waste produced by the reaction, which retains its lethal radio radioactivity for hundreds of years. Another hazard uh, is the possibility of a malfunction in the reactor that could lead to a meltdown of the core. Despite massive safety precautions, human error and equipment failures can lead to devastating accidents such as the explosion at Chernobyl in 1986. 
in which at least 30 people were killed and thousands lost their homes and for face possible long-term illness after exposure to needle-lethal doses of radiation. Because of growing public concern, the development of new nuclear power plants has slowed as scientists search for a viable solution to these problems. Of course, the red herring, or rather the, the one thing you keep pursuing here, would be the fusion reactors, which I think they've just managed to get to the point where they make a fraction of surplus energy, but that's still far far to go to make it actually actually viable. In the meantime you have other fissionable materials such as thorium, I think, that is safer. I don't know, there are options. Uh, right, solar plants, not that I need them, but sure. I have the Hoover Dam, I don't need anything else. Not yet anyway. Um, yeah, fine, get the library and be done with it. That's the last one here. All your goods have been sent out. Start building structural pieces. Oh, let's see. We try to make the people happy. Maybe they see maybe. And just smash up the courthouse and stuff. We just finish the construction queues. That's the last caravan for this town. Um, more structurals. Just a few more buildings. Mm, that one is Langolan with cloth. Oh boy. The problem is trying to remember which cities you've already supplied. That is it. Yeah, both of those are already supplied. Mm, I'm thinking I'm gonna go for. I don't know. Yeah, go to Heraclea or whatever. Any city is fine, really. I don't particularly need this stuff, but yeah, let's go there. And this one's from Rimni. Uh, did you exhaust your ability to go, go there, or...? Are you supposed to go to Halakanasis, or...? That's over there. Uh, Oh, that kind of sucks. So you mean that every time you encounter a obstacle, you'll cancel the movement order completely? Oh, that's gonna be confusing after a while. On the bright side, they even they have railroads at this point, so... It should be... Quick... Quick movements. It should have quick movements. All those scores are improved, good. And of course, he's gonna lose. There we go. Why can't they be sticky? Stick it about the freight and they transport. Till I tell it to get, tell them to go off the ship. Uh, okay, we have terraform just about everything here, and we have a cargo champ. All oh, right, that was the one that was supposed to go to Cardiff. There we go. Established trade route. And it seems we've improved all the squares in this area. Can I do anything with the city square? I don't think I can. Except transform it to planes. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see what happens. Maybe the city goes boom, I don't know. Okay, a cargo of beads. Beads, beads, beads. Oh, my, the micromanagement. The hassle. Uh, <laughs> okay, so the barbarian town wants beads. Uh, other than that, it was a Viking town. Can you move from here to Sigtuna? That's the question. You know, airlift to Capua or something. Yeah. 
get closer. Save us some movement time. And I kept. No, I forgot to buy. And buy buildings again. Dope. No, send her away. Look at this then. Okay, so they are no longer at war there either. Which is kind of bad news for us, I guess. <sighs> yeah, fuck. Get the marketplace and everything. Spy first, and then you're gonna need a, at least one, well, maybe two units of trade. I will see. Uh, do I want to talk to my people? It has been a while, sure. You're letting our crack troops go to waste, General. Let's go bonk some heads, sir. I disagree, sir. I disagree, sir. You're Einstein, sir. I mean, you are the E to the MC squared, like a clock speed doubled microchip, sir. We're number one in science. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> that was good. Let's do lunch, sir. <laughs> OK. Sir. Analysts are bullish on the performance of our latest economic indicators. We're doing great, sir. Sir, intelligence indicates that trading technologies will benefit us most at this time. Let us exploit this window of opportunity, sir. Where I come from, we don't fraternize with the enemy, General. How about yourself? I disagree, sir. Sir, the people, they can't help falling in love with you. Let's do lunch, sir. My goodness, is he eager for food? Um, <laughs> okay. Beads. That was Sigtuna, was it? Just need to double check. Yes, Sigtuna. So you're gonna go to Sigtuna. All players, uh, Sigtuna, where are you? I can't imagine why they removed this lovely little system of trade, huh? Because there is no micromanagement at all here. Ah, uh, and there it was. No hassle whatsoever. Completely effortless. I still haven't secured Capo with. Yeah, I need more spice in that area. Now why did I cut down that? That's not point. There's no point in cutting down that forest. Ugh. And you were kind of busy there, and I go there and clean pollution. And you were headed down to the Viking, the, the Mongol continent. And, uh, let's go. Okay, now, F1 was it? Yes. Because I need even more things to build every single turn. I'm gonna buy more production facilities. You're building engineers, huh? Well, in that case, I'll help you out. Uh, 
the offshore platform. Go. Factory. Go. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we have enough now. Let's switch back uh, the tax rate. Let's just grab the last few techs. I need more units to block the route over there. The Viking destroyer, I think. So we, yeah, switch us over. The squares. Yeah, fight in the marketplace, that's okay, I guess. One thing I forgot to check was if I still have a positive balance. Uh, I didn't notice. Uh, oops. Um, if I don't, it's not that big of a deal either. Cardigan builds engineers, and now they have a shortage of it. That's not good. Uh, okay, like that. Build a farm as soon as possible. Hmm. Wait, you still don't have enough production to do much of anything, my goodness. For centuries, human society has taken the gifts of nature for granted. As civilization grew, humans spread ac out across the face of the planet, taking what they needed from the land and producing, producing more and more waste materials with little regard for the future. In the late 1960s, a growing number of people became concerned about the growing problems of pollution and the destruction of natural habitats. This movement led to the formation of groups like the Environmental Protection Agency EPA, uh, the EPA's aim is to reduce all types of pollution. To this end, the agency has imposed strict laws and guidelines concerning the disposal of hazardous materials, set clean water standards, and studied more effective technologies of solid waste disposal. The primary goal of the environmental movement as a whole is to make sure that the environment is safe and intact for future generations to enjoy. Yeah, we'll see how that pans out. Um, we're gonna move straight onwards towards laser. Wait a second, solar plants... Uh, okay, are you telling me that's even... even higher level? In that case I need to switch over, I thought I'd... thought it wouldn't do any... give any, give any extra benefits, but... I'm definitely gonna do that then. Um, you built a spy, and solar plant is next. Can you tell I'm getting sort of eager to just get to the end game of this stuff? <laughs> it takes so long when you get to the hole. Ah, fiddle, fiddle, fiddle. With small things. Stage of the game. But that's the truth of pretty much all strategy games. By that time it's pretty certain that you're gonna win anyway, so... It's just a lengthy, lengthy procedure to deal with.
Okay. I think I'm gonna take a short break here, though. I have a cat that wants a bit of attention. I need to deal with that first. <laughs> so, thank you for watching. And I hope you'll continue to do so.